Hey everyone, it's Loopy Lugs Gaming here. Now welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to another video, A Little Hope. Now, in the last video, Andrew and Daniel witnessed Daniel's double David being thrown off of the bell tower of the church. We got chased by David. John told Andrew not to shoot at the shadow. Luckily we didn't, as it turned out to be Angela. The dead doubles managed to catch up with us, and we managed to escape. And we left the video standing outside one of the houses uh, at the historical restoration. Now, without further ado, let's do this. So this dude's with me. Hello, dude. Ah, okay. We talk about these fireflies. fireflies. That's what's causing the glow. The fireflies, oh my god. It's <laughs> kind of beautiful. Bray Wyatt. Don't you think? Kind of weird looking. Oh, no, this cannot be. My own eyes deceive me. No, this cannot be. My apologies for the lateness of the hour, but I must speak with you. What ails you, my friend? It is Mary. I am troubled by her, by the part she has played in these trials. Those trials trouble us all. There is more to this. I saw her smile as her own sister was executed. She took pleasure from it. Are you certain? I am. But now that she speaks of guilt and remorse, it is hard not to believe her. Keep away from her, Abraham. No good can come from being with that child. Too late. Abraham. With her brother and sister gone, Mary now lives under my roof. Your charity places you in grave danger. What do you advise? Tell the court you suspect she toys with us all. That you saw her delight in her own sister's death. I implore you. I am torn. Mary seems full of Keep remorse. Keep suspicions to yourself, and it's our community which will suffer. None of us is safe from her wild imaginings. Very well. If the court will listen, I will speak. Let's hope he's not up to something. I am bewitched. You're not bewitched. How else can your presence be explained? I, I can't explain this, but you're not. She has conjured you to defend her. To press me into silence. Only the devil could create a demon who so resembles me. I'm not a demon. But we do look alike, which I agree is pretty damn weird. What do you want from me? I want to know what you're going to say to the court about Mary. I was decided to speak to the court. Now I am not so sure. I know how this must look, but you have to speak out. Tell everyone what the girl did, like your friend is telling you to. The devil has sent you to tempt me. I must not succumb. Little Hope is no longer the town I knew. Strange and disturbing events have become commonplace. You. Whatever you are, are but one of these. Revealing the truth about Mary may save my friend, but it does not sit easily with me that in doing so I condemn a child. He's got to. Then you gotta protect your friend and speak out against her. The accusations, the executions, all that is down to her. You have to tell the truth. You are cursed, a sure sign of the devil. I don't know if we persuaded him enough. Let's hope you've done enough to stop that kid and help us get out of here. We'll see. Feels like I made a bad call. He's definitely spooked though, wasn't he? What happened? You get a chance to confront Mary? No. Nope. We never even saw her. Fuck. We saw Andrew's double. Said he was gonna speak out against Mary. That she's just a malicious kid, not some witch finder. That can only be positive.
We are seeing glimpses of what happened here hundreds of years ago. How you doing? Not great. Demons from the past? Don't know how much more of this shit I can take. One thing I didn't see coming, I feel like one of the team. I'm good with that. Never happens to me. Yeah, I hear that. Learned a few things about myself tonight. Shame it had to be from witches and ghosts. We could have used one of those, uh, what do you call it? A paladin, a holy warrior. <laughs> holy shit. I never had you down as a game geek. There's a lot more about me you don't know. I'm full of surprises. You'll see. We need to get moving. Fuck this place and this stupid ass crash that got us here. Here we go. Four sets of them. I was I was what? expecting to get caught there. Oh, shivers, man. Let's check that out. It'll get us out of these damn woods, and we can talk on the way. So we're now uh, controlling Daniel. I think with how many videos I've recorded, I think we should be getting to the end soon. What is that there? Oh, that's another one of those. Can I not shine the light a torch on it? No. Okay. Oh, they're down there. Fuck. So it's those fucking noises in the background, man. It's crazy. What happened back there with that thing? Whatever it was, it's gone, and it ain't coming back. I really hope you're right. Whatever we saw back there, or thought we saw, we're still in grave danger. That's not what I was sure expecting to say, but... There's gotta be a way out. Maybe stopping that kid. Ending the trials. I don't know. We don't know for sure that stopping Mary will help us out. It's just a theory. It may only be a theory, but right now it's all we've got. This is a one-shot deal. We get it wrong, and there's no replay. 
It's game over, so I'm up for doing whatever it takes. Come on. Let's take a look. Right, let's have a look. Anything over here? I mean, I know we've got a torch, but it doesn't seem to be lighting up fucking nothing. Why has everyone else got decent torches and I've got the shitty we think? Right. Oh, here we go. Another premonition. What have we got? Pressed into silence. Right, okay, so let's have a look at so we've got Oh god, all these Pressed into silence. So there's one, two, three, four, five. God, there's a few I miss I've missed so far. Mayor Hill's land deal. Fierce protests will surely escalate as closure looms. Okay. Here we go, another thing here. Carver for mayor. Vote Carver for mayor. Samuel Carver. Hmm. Didn't seem like a good guy. Him and his family. Right, here we go. Check this out. Hey! Is that Vince? That guy's a menace. I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. Come on, inside. Oh, shit. Well, no one's been here for a long time. <laughs> oh, you fucker. <laughs> Holy shit. Now is my time to speak before the judge. I am filled with dread. I made I me jump. I don't know how my testimony will be received. The devil has blinded so many to what is real and what is not. Nothing good will come of this. His words will seek to twist the truth. Allow me to judge what is true. Abraham and Joseph are allies in this deception. And lest we forget, you condemned Joseph to death only yesterday. Or do you now question that decision? I have heard nothing today to sway my conviction. Joseph consorted with the same malicious force as his wife. For this, the court thanks Reverend Carver, who faced the devil's wrath to present the evidence. It is only my duty, Judge. Now, however, this court is duty-bound by law to seek out the truth. We must therefore examine these claims made by Abraham against Mary. If I may speak briefly, Judge Wyman. Time is short, Reverend. Be indeed brief. Mary has shown great fortitude to speak out against the evil here. Many would have lacked her courage. Yet her reward for exposing this brooding covered in our midst is to be besmirched. Her courage is not in question. It is her intent we must be certain of. Her accuser is the very man entrusted to care for this innocent child. Plain to see he is not fit for such a task. And I would ask the court to have Mary placed elsewhere. Who would you have be her new ward, Reverend? I am prepared to take responsibility for the child. If the court agrees. First, the court must hear what Abraham has to say. No decision can be made on the child until then. Abraham! I do not know which course to take. My conscience tells me. I must speak out against Mary, but it weighs heavy on my heart to do so.
You've got to tell the judge everything. That girl is evil. Everyone needs to know it. Come on, Abraham. Tell the court what you have come here to say. Speak up, boy. Out with it! Mary has spoken of evil spirits, devilry and witchcraft. Things many cannot believe could exist here in the I'm not Hall. here for history and hearsay. Get to the point, boy. Mary confessed to me all her accusations were false. She did not see what she claimed. There was no witchcraft. There were no familiars, no devils. All were just the imaginings of a child's mind. You understand the gravity of your testimony? Yes, George, I do. Very well. You may step down. Mary is to remain with me. Given your testimony, I feel the child must go elsewhere. The Reverend Carver will be Mary's new charge by order of the court. Mm, interesting. Tell me everything. Did you see Andrew's double again? Yeah, we saw him. He told the judge that Mary made it all up. None of what she said was true. Now what? She gets taken away and does time for her lies? I'm not sure I did the right thing. I guess at least we know we can influence the outcome. That's gonna be good, right? What do you think? Is he right about this? It went down just like he said. So, Onion, Daniel and Angela. Right, let's have a look at the bearings again. Right, so Team Taylor, Taylor agreed with John's plan to head into town. Nothing new? Oh, hang on. Taylor now has uh, pulled over the wall. Right. Stranger. Vince shouted to Andrew outside the factory, telling him this will all be over soon. Mm hmm. And Joseph advised, da, da, da. yeah, we see that one and that one. Adam told Judge Myman that Mary had confessed to him her stories were of witchcraft were false. Mm, right. What the fuck? We can't stay. Let's get out of here. Oh, hang on. Examine. Uh -huh. Look at those outfits. This place shut down way, way back. Life as a kid in the 70s. Everything was ahead of me. There's got to be another exit. Maybe on the ground floor? Something hanging up on the wall here. In memory of James Clark, sadly missed by his many friends and colleagues. Oh, hang on. Okay, so let's go into this room. Oh, looks like something flashing here. Examine. Kiss my ass. Oh. Mr. Vincent Barnes, 15 Mayflower Avenue, number 7, Little Hope, MA, date uh, May 8th, 1972. Dear Mr. Barnes, subject employment warning letter. What? Oh, that's ridiculous, man. So you're... 
the hand say. So you have to hold the trigger to keep a hold of it. Then you gotta go and turn the motherfucker, and then you've gotta scroll down. Oh, scrolling down with the other stick, that's fine. These fucking games, right? Dear Mr. Barnes, subject employment warning letter. Following our recent disciplinary meeting, I am writing regarding your attendance and behaviour. Management have made every effort to accommodate your difficult circumstances and recent injury by accepting your reoccurring absences. However, continued warnings regarding attendance, lateness and intoxication have prompted us to issue a formal written warning. Further rep repetition of this behaviour or other misconduct within the next 12 months will result in the dismissal. Ravenden expects our employees to be enthusiastic, punctual and sober. You must acknowledge receipt of this letter. Please sign and return to the foreman's office within seven days. Unreadable. And he's wrote, kiss my ass on the back of it. Right, okay. What have we got here? Another secret found a family photo. Get over here. You gotta see this. Oh, is this gonna be the family that the died in the start? This is too much. Way too fucking much. First, a load of weirdo witch killers from ancient history look just like us. Now we got the creepy family of the year winners who also look just like us. What the actual fuck? What does it mean though? Do you think they died like the other lookalikes? No clue. Who knows what happened to them? Maybe we're all stuck in the same nightmare. You really want a souvenir? From this night? From this place? All I know, I'm keeping hold of this. Well, that's all we got time for in today's video. And remember, guys, if you want to get your hands on some Wraith, the link in the description, Loopy10 at checkout for 10% off. Thanks for watching another video of Little Hope. If you've liked it, whoosh, high five that like button. And if you want to see more, be sure to smash that subscription button down below. And last but not least, remember, life's a game. So play it well. I'll see you in my next video.